Hey Elixirs! Welcome to the first video of our brand new series, iPop Revolution. Imagining K-pop culture in India, could iPop be the next big thing? If you've ever wondered why India doesn't have something like K-pop yet, stick around as we explore how iPop could shake up the Indian music scene. So, what exactly is K-pop? K-pop stands for Korean pop, a genre that originated in South Korea. But it's much more than just music. It's high energy performances, killer choreography, and super stylish visuals. Think catchy tunes, slick dance moves, and eye-catching music videos. Major names like BTS, Blackpink, and EXO have set the bar high with their incredible performances and massive fan bases. Imagine if K-pop's high-octane energy and epic fandoms took over India. Picture dazzling dance routines, killer fashion, and a fan craze like nothing we've seen before. Today, we're exploring what it would take for an Indian pop revolution with a K-pop twist. How would it look? What would it take? And could we see our own homegrown idols rising to global fame? How about we imagine K-pop like culture in India? Let's compare India and South Korea and break it down step by step to see if it's even possible. Remember, this is just a casual discussion. No offense intended. I'd love to hear your thoughts. So drop a comment below and let's chat about it. Let's break down the entertainment industries in South Korea and India. South Korean entertainment companies. Firstly, my favorite, High Corporation. Formerly Big Hit Entertainment, Hive is home to global superstars like BTS and TXT. They're known for their extensive artist training and international success. YG Entertainment, known for groups like Blackpink and Winner, YG is all about edgy, high fashion vibes. SM Entertainment, with artists like EXO and NCT, SM has an extensive training system and a strong influence in K-pop. JYP Entertainment, Known for catchy tunes and dynamic performances, JYP has produced hits from TWICE and GOT7. Indian Entertainment Companies T-Series Dominates Bollywood with its massive collection of film soundtracks and music videos. Sony Music India Collaborates with popular Bollywood artists and a growing number of independent musicians. Z Music Company and Tips Industries known for their extensive Bollywood and regional music catalogs. Industry Models Comparison South Korean companies like Hive and YG focus heavily on global expansion with well-defined training systems. They have a robust international market strategy. In contrast, Indian entertainment companies are deeply rooted in Bollywood and regional film industries, focusing on local audiences with film soundtracks and music videos. Emerging Indian Music Platforms Nexa, a unique name in the industry, Nexa, known for its premium cars, also has a music platform supporting emerging indie artists. They host live events and provide opportunities for new talent. Kyuki Music Co-founded by A.R. Rahman, Kyuki focuses on bringing together artists from various genres and regions, fostering creativity and innovation in the Indian music scene. The Print Article and McCleary's Vision According to The Print, McCleary is set on ushering in the era of iPod and believes his approach offers something stronger than current international pop music. He emphasizes creating a band that's not manufactured, where members are deeply involved in every stage of the creative process. McCleary acknowledges that while the K-pop model, with its global additions and rigorous talent scouting, might not fully translate to an Indian context. The focus on artist development is something that can be adapted. Even if you have artists who are already talented, there's still a lot of development needed. And I think we've done the right amount of that before launching Wish, he says. Spotlight on Wish. Now, let's shine a light on Wish, the exciting new girl group from Sony Music India. Wish made their debut on March 1, 2024 with their single Lizzie's which means delicious or tasty in Urdu. This track is part of their debut 8-track album and blends English and Hindi, merging international pop with Indian vibes. With vibrant energy, engaging choreography, and stylish visuals wish. 
is definitely making waves in the Indian pop scene. So, what does the future hold for iPop in India? Could we see a K-pop-like phenomenon with a distinct Indian twist? It's an exciting possibility with the potential for vibrant new music and fan experiences. Indian entertainment companies don't quite have the intense artist management setups like we see in K-pop just yet. But there's tons of potential to build something similar. If they focus on hardcore training, 24-7 management, and all-around career development, they could seriously level up the talent game. This kind of approach could help artists blow up both locally and globally. What do you think? Could iPop become the next big thing in India and worldwide? Drop your thoughts in the comments below and let's chat about it. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any future videos in our iPop Revolution series. See you next time.